Hello everyone, I'm Crystal Snapdragon, and in this video, I'm just going to talk to you guys a little bit about my thoughts and opinions on the beginning combat for the Berserker class in Bless Unleashed. So these are essentially just my opinions and how I feel about the combat from levels 1 through 10. So this is the beginning combat. It could easily be different further down the line. The question is, do I want to continue playing this class past level 10? The answer is probably no. So feel free to let me know how you feel about this class in the comments below, whether you want to continue playing it, whether it gets better past level 10. Right now I'm just going to tell you I'm not going to play it past level 10. I find this class to be really boring. I don't feel any satisfaction from killing enemies and defeating the field bosses with this class. I feel like it's incredibly unrefined. So first off, I also want to say how much of a disappointment it is that the Varg race is locked to the Berserker class. So Vargs can't be any other class, and then only the Varg can be a Berserker. So no other race can be a Berserker. It's, it's a little odd that you have this class lock and racial lock. It's, it's a little disappointing, to be honest, because I love the Varg race. And if you're unfamiliar with what the Varg is, it's essentially the humanoid beast wolf race in this game, although I feel like the female Varg look closer to felines than they do to canines. And I love this race, but I don't like this class, and I hate that it's locked to it. I would rather play a Varg ranger, because the lupus race as a ranger was pretty good in Bless Online. And if you're unfamiliar with what Bless Online was, that was the sort of original version of this game that came out for a PC, but it, ooh, it faltered so bad. I don't know what was worse, No Man's Sky or Bless Online when it came to like the release of the game. Bless Online couldn't bounce back. No Man's Sky at least bounced back. But Bless Online, ooh, that plummeted and it just stayed where it hit the ground. It was just bad. And so they released Bless Unleashed for Xbox. I like the game a lot better than Bless Online for the PC, but I felt like you had a lot more freedom with what you wanted your character to be with Bless Online. Bless Unleashed, I feel, limits you a little more, and it's a little frustrating. But anyway, about this class, I, I don't like the combat at all. I find it rather clunky and unrefined. You are, of course, a humanoid beast larger than life, wielding this incredibly large axe, and it feels that way. And it should, right? It should feel really heavy because you're wielding such a large axe. It really should feel heavy, but it also feels rather clunky. You have a hard time targeting your enemies, and then you have a hard time staying targeted on your enemy. And because it is close combat DPS, if you're... <laughs> Of course, out of range, it's going to be really hard to get in range. So you want to make sure that you stay nearby. But because it's so hard to target your enemies and stay locked onto them, you always find yourself sort of, uh, think of it as centrifugation, where you're moving towards the perimeter <laughs> farther and farther away rather than closer. It's a little frustrating. It's, it's so hard to target and stay on target. And even when you are on target, some of the moves, they don't work out. Like you have this move where you jump up in the air and you kind of cannonball down with your ax. And even when you're locked on target, it overshoots. I don't understand, I haven't been able to figure out what causes it to overshoot and when it works correctly as it should. It's really frustrating. And it's just not, satisfactory to play. I find <laughs> I I just don't like playing it. I get rather bored with it. If I think about playing it, I actually make that sigh where you're like, oh, do I really? Oh, I guess. Because it's just not fun. I still maintain that the mage is my favorite class as of this right now. The mage is still my favorite class and I've played the ranger, the berserker, the priest, and I've even looked at the Crusader a little bit, and I still maintain that the Mage is my favorite class. Berserker has to be my least up to this point. And I still do not agree with the developers. I feel like they would have a better time refining these skills 
for each of their classes if they actually thought about what role they would play. But the developers said that they don't want to give them their classes roles, that they don't want to have classes limited to what they can be, and I get that. But if you decide on what a primary role for a class would be, it'd be so much easier to have an overall picture of what type of skills that class should have, right? And so I think they're kind of shooting themselves in the foot by not doing that. And it gives all the characters an identity crisis. It's a little frustrating. Notice I'm saying frustrating a lot. That's how much I don't like this class and I will not continue playing it unless somebody can tell me and assure me that it gets better as you start to unlock more blessings. But I need like assurance if I'm gonna waste that much time into a class. Mage, I can assure you right now, gets a lot better. The combos get better. It becomes a lot easier to mitigate damage and sort of, I guess, dodge attacks. I feel like it's a lot harder to dodge attacks as a big wolf. <laughs> it, it's really difficult as opposed to like an elf mage. And the combos for the Berserker just don't get any better, in my opinion. I think, you know, in a word, it's boring. It's a boring class. I don't recommend it. I recommend a mage as of this point. Let me know how you feel about it, whether you feel differently, whether it gets better, whether you agree with me. I just, I don't know. <laughs> this class, I have, I mean, I like the armor, the look of the armor. It doesn't matter though, I'm still squishy because that of course depends on gear score, but. But anyway, those are my thoughts on this this class. I just, I don't like it guys and I don't think I, <laughs> I ever will. But please sub if you haven't already. Let me know how you feel about this class again, whether you enjoyed it, whether you didn't. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, everyone.